So we're here for I'm opening the gates for the first day of the 50th anniversary celebrations. It's not like these have been given any badges, but we're the third car in. Here we go, let's see what happens. into the next one because there's rhinos are trying to get out we're already at the gate the rhino attacking the jeep there which is a good sign look he's trying to push the rhino away so we can open the gates for us to get in the rhino's having none of it so far we've only got one gate open we've got the animals walking around trying to get food so we're looking into people's cars baby rhino there and we've got more gates open but that's quite a big spike so I don't fancy that in car
well it's uh, the 50th birthday it's looking like it's going to be a busy day I'm not sure what these are some sort of cattle Mm -hmm. We just need them to open gates for us. Keep walking as well, we keep getting ahead of all queues and then. So we're still having problems with them trying to move giraffes' front gate so we can open the gate to let us in. giraffes away before we can open the gate so now we're going to drive from an area with no giraffes <sighs> so that's one bad bad mark all the giraffes have been put away in that green building so we can drive through this section and see nothing at all so we might have to come round again later in the afternoon if it's not too busy Peering on the fence waiting for food from us, but obviously we're going to get there, so now we're just driving through sections with no animals. Yeah, we're going to get to the so we're still at the front of the queues, but there's no animals to see. Got some little uh, reindeer type things here which Everybody will be wanting to see now because I haven't seen an animal for ages. So I've got one walking here. I think it says. Mm -hmm. This one's looking for food, it's licking his lips. Something outside. You're allowed to feed animals here with four pounds to get some food. Obviously there's some animals that look like they can't really roam around so they're mating animals. <laughs> we stopped when we came. Sorry if I'm ruining that magical moment for you. So it looks like oh, carnivore bypass, so we're not going bypass. It looks like we're going into carnivore section. This one 
land of the painted dog. We like painted dogs. green light for us to go in. And let's see, oh, it looks like there might be a waiting for gate to open again. She's getting a bit of a, a pain. This ain't good. So, African wild dog, hopefully we'll see some of these. Realised that the gate has to close behind us before the gate in front opens so that dogs can't escape. So we haven't got a green light. We've got green light now, we're about to go in. So hopefully see some packs of African wild dogs. Exciting. We've only seen these behind our hands before, we haven't seen them actually up close and personal. Oh they're nice ones. Yeah, we're better be walking around here. We made it through the painted dogs. We're just in another airlock section where the closing gate behind us in a bit and that gate in front should open. It's all quite nice. That's the closest we've been to painted dogs. Don't know what section we're going through now. Optional off-road track. Why would you look at that? <laughs> off-road track. There's an off-road track down here but I don't think we'll be doing it because our vehicle can't even cope on road so off-road it will uh, will be definitely coming to a get us so if you can see through the back window that gate's just shutting now and then when that one's shut which is just about to be shut now should open to whatever section we're going into now which I can't, oh, I can't see anything so I don't know whether it's another painted dog pack must be, because we'll probably have different packs so See what we see. But well, there's an off-road section. Oh, lion! Straight there, waiting oh, for us. Wow. One across the other side. So. Mm -hmm. One just over that side. We come just through the barrier, and then there's a nice big one just here. Which hopefully, if he's moving from, we can get quite close up. Tower up there with marksman. Nice 
profile area. I don't like how these little sections are closed off so that they let like five or six cars in and wait for them to get round rather than have too many cars. It's quite a big area, I think they're, they're parking up here because they're waiting for us to be able to all get together. the next airlock now which we believe is uh, the White Lions, the Kingdom of White Lions, these statues. There's another car behind us that's gonna, we're gonna have to wait to get into airlock before they can let us in. Just about to close now, so this one should start opening now. See, oh, it's closed because something's gone wrong. Most lions must be walking this way. They opened it and up, it's closed. See, try again. I don't think I've seen any white lions in real life. So let's see what white lions are like in real life. Painted dogs in that section, they're all playing, chasing each other around. Oh, the sleeping, sleeping white lions.
We've got a VIP tour going on in front of us though. Doing a paparazzi shooting. Got some meat over at the far end. Mm -hmm. We're having a nice chew. Try and get this one stood up if he don't set off. Will jump on it. Wow. Oh, look, this one might be jumping on this one. Full of crows. We're going into grasslands. Going into the grasslands next. Are you ready to move? Yeah. Well, gates opening. Take advantage of it. So, the grasslands. A VIP tour. Don't know how much they cost. If I find any information, I'll. Uh, Put it up on the side. Job we got to the front because it's uh, a bit gridlocked now with traffic. Uh, other than missing out on giraffes, so far we've done all right. We've actually seen everything, but I think you can walk to giraffes as well if I'm not mistaken. But we'll find out in a bit. Well, that's a doll. Not a doll whip. Just a doll. Section before we close it. There's another one there. Mm. Oh, another one down there that's awake. Yeah. Back to the Wild Asia section. Possibly some more of them. Indian rhino. Got more more armor on them. I think all the ones that we've seen before are black rhinos. I thought they were yeah, they're great, but I think they're called black rhinos.
to save your own food and all that when you come with one of
down. Oh, yeah. Yes. Saying everything we want to say. Mm -hmm. We've been an hour, but most of that hour has been waiting to um, get through gates. I don't know how far we're through it. They did give us a map, but we're not looking at map. I think all oh, big animals, we? yeah, because this is where we're this where it was big held up now, we're back to where giraffes were, so hopefully they've let some out now. Zebras across there, blocking all traffic. Not allowed to feed zebras. This girl's got a window open and he's just looked in, but I don't think you're allowed to feed him. He's just looking at me as if to say, I'm gonna take your car out, mate. I don't know to go on the side of him. Zebra crossing. That Look at that, they said no feeding and she's there uh, checking hand look, he's coming here. Mm -hmm. All them people over there, well, I don't know. Maybe you're allowed to pat them, but you can't fucking feed them. <laughs> so that's the entrance down there. You can see car park fairly full. It says, don't touch or feed zebras, camels, Barnaby sheep. So that's how much people pay attention. So I think we did well to Toilets and exit, so that's the driving section done. Don't know whether we'll do it later, depending on how queues are. Uh, now, let's go see the rest at park.